If you're going to have sex with strangers and you're not using a condom, I mean, you're an idiot. Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel. My name is Rafael and today I'm going to talk about the rubber dam and why you should use it and a condom and what these two have in common. First of all, for anybody who's watching who doesn't know what a rubber dam is, basically it's just a piece of latex or some other material that your dentist places over the tooth when doing a root canal treatment or any other restorative treatment for that matter. It's used for isolation, so it's similar as a condom, except with the rubber dam we want to keep things out and with the, uh, with the condom we want to keep things in. Why is isolation so important, you might think? Well, the main purpose of a root canal treatment is to get bacteria out of the root canal. So you can imagine with a little bit, a little bit of logical thinking that when you're doing a root canal treatment and one drop of saliva with millions of bacteria comes inside, it will affect the outcome of the root canal treatment. Now, this, this is where the controversy starts because on a dental forum, there's always this one guy or girl that goes like there's no study that proves the outcome of a root canal treatment is affected by the use of a rubber dam. Of course there isn't. It's unethical to perform a study like that. Just imagine doing this with, with a condom. That would mean that you would have one group of men having sex with a group of women and they use a condom. And now any good study needs a control group. So there would be another group of men having sex with another group of women and they wouldn't use a condom. And then the question you would ask is, would there be a difference in the pregnancy rate? I mean, of course there is going to be a difference in the pregnancy rate. Now, you don't only use condoms to avoid pregnancy. I mean, you also use a condom to avoid things like HIV, chlamydia, gonorrhea, you know, all those nasty things you just don't want to get. It's the same with the rubber dam. I mean, you don't only use it for isolation, you also don't want your patients to swallow instruments. You don't want your patients to swallow the chemicals we use to clean the root canals. It's more efficient to use it and now with the COVID, COVID pandemic, it's even more hygienic. So these are all things that are good enough reasons to use it besides the isolation. I mean, so in short, it's, it's actually very simple with these two. If you're going to have sex with strangers and you're not using a condom, I mean, you're an idiot. And if you're going to do root canal treatment and you're not going to use a rubber dam, well, if you thought the video was any good, hit like. If you want to see more content, then subscribe. And if you really want to piss off some dentist, just share this video in some online dental groups. Sit back and enjoy the show.